This video is about miracles, to resurrect, to summon, and what they actually are. A lot of people who are new to this idea will be like, well, no shit. Of course that's the case. There's a reason why the priest's vestments and outfit, you know, the Catholic priest, looks like a martial art gi. And Europe and Asia are side by side. Huh, I wonder, wonder why that is. You know, obviously, religion comes from African martial arts societies who spread around the world. People are just basically Africans that went around the world and mixed with other people. And some of them assimilated Neanderthals and so on and so forth. And you can tell who's close, more closely related to who by their nose, by their skin color at times, their bone structure, their eyes, right? What kind of spirit do they have, right? Family and familiar spirits. So first let's, let's consider the obvious and how society works. People uh, are shown movies and different stories with morals, right? Morals. What L are you, right? More L, right? Are you mentally L and you turn your back on morality? Are you more like the devil? Are you more like Baal? Are you more like Set or Min? Are you more like, you know, uh, Anu, uh, Ki? Are you more like Shamish? You know, who are you more like, right? The moral of the story. You know, some indigenous deity somewhere, perhaps. Okay, and it has characters, right? Core actors, right? Characters. Core act ears, right? Who do you see yourself in? So there's associations that are being made suddenly. And as you go through life, it is obvious that you see ideas that remind you of yourself to some degree. And your behavior, therefore, regardless of how the drugs have made you susceptible, is more of your, natu your nature expressing yourself where your reservations and inhibitions are reduced and the things that you're more uh, suggestible to, right? The more the, the things you're more likely to uh, choose to do due to suggestions, um, these things are what you end up doing, pretty much. And this tells you who you are, what kind of character you have, right? Character in a movie, someone's character. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. So we have conditioning and chemical reactions, but so what? You know, if you're naturally a warrior, you can grow you can grow up in a in a in a pussy town, and then find the warrior inside of you you're never going to be comfortable. You know, it's the ugly duckling effect. Okay, it's very obvious that this is how things work. Okay. So characters, association, conditioning, channeling. And this goes back to the sort of magic spell, right? You know, who summoned me? If you're summoning the idea of a very serious spirit, are you going to be Harry Potter or Willow? Or on some bitch shit, right? Are you going to be a female? Right, let's face it, they don't have the masculine spiritual power to understand these ideas. In fact, it's right there in the word summon. Sum, right, DNA backwards is and, sum, total, man, right, summon, okay? This goes back to the word min, meaning the deity of chemists, right? It's a very important deity, I bring, uh, bring them up all the time. Minus, okay, if you're resorting to chemistry, minus the man, min, minus the man eyes, right? If you turn to men, thus the word minus, okay? So if you're using technology, right, instead of natural uh, uh, martial arts conditioning, right, if you're going beyond free weights, minus the man, right, and these people use, used to use creatine when I was younger, they use various substances to put on more muscle mass, right, and miss and mass are connected. You miss the point because you're more like the miss who is more associated with the earth, that's the term Mother Earth. It's very straightforward. What really makes the man is willpower, and he's natural willpower. Not setting the stage like the West loves to do, so that some groups that are more closely related to them and associated with them seem to look better. You're an idiot if you think I'm mistaken here. You are the one who are mistaken. It's right there in the word. Mistake. Who's taken from whom? You think someone who is good looking as I used to be, magically would be shunned by attractive women? Obviously, they're being conditioned and bred, right, bred, to be evil, and to be attracted to evil things. So what this long-term process ends up doing from generation to generation, is a sort of epigenetic evolution where females' brain function is basically misfunction, right? It's basically malfunction. It's basically not doing what it's supposed to do. So where they think the malfunction is the male function, in reality, it's acting like a bitch or a witch, right? You know, that switches, switch, witch, bitch, right? So that some mentally ill fuck can scratch an itch instead of truly man up and face the world, right? Horus, face us. Also, whore eyes, right? The whore that rides the beast, right? He looks at things and says, hey, you're a prostitute, okay? 
Females in the ghetto, every attractive female in the ghetto, for example, she's a prostitute. Everyone in the ghetto knows it, right? If she doesn't sell her soul and her body for sex and become a hooker because she's hooked on something, addiction, a dick shun, for who? The beta. Beta scrambled is beast. If she doesn't become an open prostitute, she goes into the work world and finds a career, right? Core, ear. What is your core, right? Money is the root of all evil. She becomes a gold digger. And men and mining and minus are connected. And therefore, so is men and amen and moon and mint, right? The, the money, right? The mint, okay? And so on and so forth, okay? This moon temple bitch shit. The moon E, okay? And of course you have the ass, right? And you can imagine how people are hooked on rump and the trump card, okay? To tr you know, and so on and so forth, okay? So, and the trap, right? And so on and so forth. So we look at resurrection, summon, and miracle. If I lost you there, who fucking cares? Just listen to this part right here, okay? Resurrection. Raise your raw C in. Ra's erection. Why? Because it's the phallic symbol. It is the idea of the reproductive cycle. You see how this is something for people who man up and who are mature. Not sissies and some kind of gender neutral earth spirit like, hi guys! Oh, that's so funny! Like acting like a bitch. You see what I'm saying? If you're in the repetition of that every day, it's one thing to mock them real quickly. It's another thing to be in the repetition of being a bitch. You know, it's like in the repetition of eating donuts and sitting on the couch and you expect to have Atonement, right? A tone, alpha tone, naturally, with the true spirit of God, with no ill gotten gains, it's not going to happen. You're in a lazy, demonic, gluttony, lust filled spirit, watching some sexualized bullshit, pretty much, okay? You know, more often than not, at least, one way or another, that's what it connects to. So, Ra's ear, Ra see, shun, right? Who do you listen to about who you should shun? It leads us to the next one Ra, so, say, see, sigh. Ha! <sighs> okay? They're acting like a bitch. Okay? They're not obeying the divine order. And an attractive female comes up to me and says, Should I date him? Ha! <sighs> really? I have to explain to you why someone who doesn't obey God through the top martial artist shouldn't be dated? I really have to explain that. That's why sigh is part of the kind of wordplay with the interchangeable vowels, vow to L meaning Lord, okay? Versus vow to L, I L L meaning all the ill bitches who run society. And on record, Right, uh, here it is in their, their own kind of greater publication network. It says that 20% of CEOs are psychopaths, right? Is your vow to the L Fox, okay? And then, of course, we add all the other mental disorders that only exist outside the divine order, and you get bitch, 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 bitch. All CEOs are evil scum, okay? All right. So I did summon already, summon backwards, sum on, same on, right? It's, it's from the same bloodline. It's so, it's so consistent that it's like saying the, the son of the falcon is the falcon, okay? We don't expect a rat to magically have a falcon. We don't expect a lion and so on and so forth, right? It's consistent, okay? Some man, right? Also backwards, no miss, right? New miss, okay? And no miss, no bitch shit. A new female that you're in love with, right? And then the first time you make love, right, with no, with no condom, boom, you impregnate this person. This is part of a divine ritual to bring this about. Do I think it has to be done like this every time? No. Okay, is it is it maximizing your chances of success? I do believe that that makes sense. Okay, it also goes back to no mass and no mess, right? You try to try to be on point, right? Be on point. This is the martial art mind brings order to things, but not in the beta way that you see these other systems do, where they separate from society and get all pretty like a mason. Don't confuse the masonic mixed with the circus tricks with true martial arts. Don't confuse the brute force mixed with, you know, uh, mixed with the media bullshit with true martial arts. Okay. So it leads us to miracle, more a call. Why do you think it's more a call? You know, should God listen to some sissy beta bitch who's trying to find his life in this world? By default, you have to be in the alpha order, right? To even have the possibility, okay? And it's a conveyance, it's coming down, it's trickle down spiritual power, okay? Also, ear, your, and you are, a, right? They're listening to you, right? Ear, a, uh, excuse me, ear, a, call. Your, a, call. You are, a, call. Your, a, call, okay? You, ear, sell, because, you know, miracle. You know, you can remove the M because it stands for magic. You can remove the M, you can remove the T, you can remove the H, okay? And I put it in uh, one of these playlists, uh, you know, the Resurrection playlist, the Top Martial Arts playlist, why that is, all the things, the lexicon, the alphabet, 
right? Interchangeable vowel L and all this stuff that kind of overkills my point as to the magic spell being real. Okay, and of course, this goes back to the magic spell to begin with. Okay, why does the magic spell exist? It's because these people are trying to channel, mimic, right? A mime, a pantomime, I believe it's called. These people are trying to take on these aspects so they can impress other people. It's the old, let's emulate the top martial artist and pretend we're important and democratize his powers, you know, do it as a group, right? And, you know, kind of gang rape in its true form, which is people organizing to control sexual re reproduction, right? Unfairly outside of the divine order, okay? And, and, and then they pretend they're important. And we see this in various forms. We see this with politicians, right? We see this with the other quote-unquote martial artists, Okay, we see this with scientists. We see this with businessmen. We see this in so many different ways in society. People basically acting like bitches. All right. So um, we also so with the miracle we have uh, um, ear a cell or ear a ka le. Okay, listen to the a and the ka le. Also, we get the E, lack, raw. Remove the M and go backwards and scramble the C and the A. So scramble and ram, bowl are connected. Scramble, you can move the S because it's plural and you can do words forwards and backwards and scramble so you can remove the S, right? We get C, ramble, ram, bowl, the baphomet and ball, okay? And Zeus is compared to bowl, a bowl, right? Jupiter, ball, Jupiter, another name for Zeus the bowl that covers the light, right? Basketball, play ball, baseball, football, right? And these are sports with the T instead of the spar. Without the T, the T is the feminine suffix. That's why they say ready, set, go in racing, for example. And of course, it has the word race. So obviously they're putting their race above God, above the truth. And this is failure every time. Just to be from a culture that emphasizes race above God and above truth, by default, you're, you're a satanic snake. That's why it's the grand dragon of the Ku Klux Klan. And this goes back to snaking the Garden of Eden, Apep, the ancient serpent, the constellation Draco in the north epileptic or elliptic pole, which is Anu, the Sumerian sky god, which also goes back to the north pole, which is Santa, which is Satan scrambled, like Santa Clara, Santa Barbara, Santa Monica, Santa Cruz, all in California, which goes back to Cali, which is one of the divas like Indian deities, if not a diva itself, which is basically a demon or a devil diva, which goes back to Hollywood, the holy wood, the occult, the O, the reproductive cycle, raw sun disc, which goes back to the Hollywood diva, okay? All bitch shit, all bitch shit, all bitch shit, okay? Fuck do you think it is? You think that's a decent way to live your life? You think that children should look up to these harlots? And when they, when they, when they act important, you know what I'm saying, and get people to do, to sink to the, you know, I wish I had one of those. Instead of looking at these females and coming together and saying, hey, stop being a stupid ass bitch. Stop being an evil whore demanding that men act like sips. Oh, she, she's, she's looking at me. <clears throat> what do I say to her? What do I say to her, right? That's a stupid way to do things. I mean, think about it. It's stupid. It's not how you should reproduce. A bunch of females showing their ass and tits, having men feel all, all, kind, all some kind of way about it, and every once in a while one flips out and becomes a serial rapist or something. This is not how you do the reproductive cycle. They should obey and have reverence for the top martial artist, for the true martial art order that ends with me. Okay? They should obey. Because when they don't, they automatically become divas. Or they're sex slaves. There's no other way. I'll give you $1,000 if you can think of a single viable counter-argument, right? True counter-argument. That there can be any other way outside of them being going toward being a diva and the spectrum and being sex slaves and the spectrum. Anything but the divine order, they are profane harlots by default. Think about it. You know, you're not giving the top martial arts his rightful place. What are you doing? You're ignoring the ideal man, men every generation. What are you doing? You're whoring yourself to evil scum for things that are obviously wrong. It is wrong to be like Rihanna, to be like Lady Gaga. It is wrong to be a corporate slut. Secretary, secret eros. Okay? It is wrong. Secret ear eye. Career, core ear. It is wrong to prostitute yourself to Babylon system, which is more than just the government and law enforcement. It is the entire system, which includes every culture that is compatible with the system. And that includes the controlled opposition. 
If you're trying to bring in communism, that's a uh, Babylon system. Socialism, Babylon system. Capitalism, Babylon system. 